Hello. In this video, I want to talk about the UB Gear pass through uh, crimper and connectors uh, for Ethernet uh, jacks. So, traditionally, I've used a pair of crimpers like this um, for putting ends on Ethernet cable. And you have to cut the end of the cable to a specific length and line it up. And it can be kind of tricky to do. And, uh, you know, my eyes aren't getting any better. And uh, I found a better way to do this. So instead of using these crimpers, I use these UB Gear crimpers. Um, I got these on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description to these, and I'll put a link um, to the uh, connectors I got that go with them. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. But we'll look at the um, the two RJ45 um, connectors here. If you look on the left, there's holes through here, and on the right, there's not. So what you do is you cut your wires long and you run them through here and when you crimp them, it cuts them. So I'll demonstrate that here. I'll get the old stuff out of the way. Um, and uh, the connectors I'm using, um, I have regular connectors and then I've used these shielded connectors also. They make both types. So on the crimper, there's a uh, stripper here so we can take the sheathing off. We'll come in a couple inches, tighten it down, and I'll twist it. Okay, and now I can pull that off. And you want to make sure that didn't nick any of your conductors here. And then I'll use these uh, little side cutters I have here. I'll cut the uh, pull wire through off. Um, so you see I have four pairs here. And um, I'm going to wire this to the T568B specification. So I'll uh, unwind all the conductors. Okay, so I have all the conductors um, untwisted here. So I want to do an uh, orange stripe. Well, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to straighten all these out. I like to use a little screwdriver here and um, kind of take the twist out. It makes them easier to work with. Okay, so I want to go uh, orange stripe orange, green stripe blue, blue stripe green, brown stripe brown. So I have these lined up. I'll straighten them out and then I'm going to check them. So I have orange stripe orange, green stripe blue, blue stripe green, brown stripe brown. So I need to have them all lined up at the end here. And then I'll take the um, the end. It's a little overlap there. And I'm going to slide these in, and then when you slide them in, you can confirm that your colors are correct. So orange stripe orange, green stripe blue, blue stripe green, brown stripe brown. And then I can uh, push this in, or pull it through. Okay. Oops. So now that I know everything's uh, perfectly lined up, I can stick it in here. I found this to be a little tricky at times because it'll get caught on the blade. So you want to pinch it at the end. I'll stick it in here and then I'll press it all the way down. And this blade will cut off the conductors there and I'll have a nice crimped end. So. I found this to be a lot easier than using the old style where you have to cut them to the exact length and slide them in there and they get twisted up. This um, I found much easier. And this is uh, relatively affordable. I don't remember the exact price, but uh, you look on Amazon, um, especially if it's worth your time. If you're messing with these and have a lot of trouble, I found these to be a lot faster. So um, a couple of things here. If you're using a shielded cable, um, I found it helps to take a pair of pliers and kind of smash the uh, end here before you stick it into the connect, uh, connector because it, it's a tight fit there. So it helps to kind of smash that down. Um, 
but that's uh, kind of the basics of uh, this UB gear pass through crimper and connectors. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like and thanks for watching. Bye.